We are in the clouds. Check this out. Yeehaw! That smells so good. It looks a little sketchy. Here we go. Wow, it's so creaky. Wow. Oh this town is so beautiful though. Behind me here is the oldest mosque in all of the Caucasus. Apparently we're going to an alpaca farm. Wow, what a way to end the trip. Good morning guys, this is Doug. I am here in Gabala, Azerbaijan. Today we're gonna to be exploring the Gabala region more and we are, I think, taking a cable car to the top of the mountains somewhere up there, so it's gonna be really cool. Over the next couple days, we're gonna be exploring more of this area, and I think, from what I've been told, some of the more natural, scenic parts of Azerbaijan. But as usual, I'm going with the flow. I'm showing you guys what I find. All right, up we go to the cable car. Man, it is beautiful here. Mountains and everything. Is this for skiing during the winter? Yeah, yeah? okay. Woo! Okay. It's a long way down. It's a long way down. <laughs> All right, guys. So right now we are looking over Gabala. It's right there. This is one of the biggest cities in Azerbaijan. The town is at the base of the third tallest mountain in Azerbaijan, Tufanda. And right up there, behind the clouds, you can see Tufanda. There's some snow up there. Hello, hello, welcome back. Oh, oh. They're alive. <laughs> You're alive, you made it down, congratulations. Yeah. So we've made it down. I think we might be going back up uh, another one. We're here now. We just went up to that one. Now we're gonna go this one, and then that one up to the top. The, the second one is more amazing and more beautiful. All right. It's, it has more distance. Yes. More amazing and more beautiful. Yatmış göze means uh, sleeping beauty. Ooh. Okay. Because uh, this uh, mountain uh, looks like the girl who sleeps. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we made it up to the tallest point now. We are in the clouds, check this out. I mean, we are literally among the clouds here. Pretty incredible. Nice cool air up here, I'm loving this. Alright guys, we're in a village now uh, that is and has been historically populated by the Udi Caucasian Albanians. And I asked many times because I couldn't really believe it, but they have nothing to do with modern day Albania. They're not ethnically related, nothing. It's a coincidence or they somehow got the name and took it. But anyway, we wanna show you guys inside one of their traditional homes. It's set up as a museum now. Here's what it looks like from the outside. And it's really cool on the inside. Traditional house out here in the countryside. So let's go check it out. <laughs> This kind of scared me when I first walked in. <laughs> These are figures of the former residence. He was a barber, and this is his father. So he's giving him a haircut. There we are together. And in the other room, this one kind of freaks me out even more because <laughs> it's dark in here. <laughs> this looks so real, I literally feel like this woman is about to jump at me. <laughs> anyway, I think this is the aunt. There's an old TV from the 70s. Soviet times, of course. All right, let's go out. Thank you so much. Thank you. So now I think we're gonna have some tea real quick. Some chai. Oh, there's a cat here. Hi, kitty. Hello. I'm so sorry, but I have to move the chair. Sorry, kitty. This is a water from rose flower. Ooh, do you put it you in can, the tea? Yeah, you can put it. Not that okay. Yeah, like Just a little bit, you think? Like. <laughs> I mean more. Okay. Let's try it out. Mm, tasty. By the way, guys, this is our. She's one of the organizers of our tour, so thank you so much for organizing thank everything. Also. Thank you for coming. These are sweet cherries, and they're in like, but they're orange and they're in like a really thick, sweet syrup. Like that. Oops. 
<laughs> They're very tasty. All right, guys, we just got to lunch and check out the restaurant here. It's pretty cool. So, Max, what do you think is going to be for lunch, man? I'm not sure. Like, it's either lamb or lamb. Oh, it could be lamb. That's true. But I'm not sure which one. Yeah. It's like, it's hard to say. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm kind of uh, stunned. I'm, ho I'm hoping for a lamb. Yeah. We have three options here, by the way. Uh -huh. Yeah, like we can have lamb, or there's an option for lamb as well. Oh. And if you don't like lamb at all, so you can have lamb. Oh, oh, because yeah. we thought there was only two options. That's no, no, amazing. There are three, three. Uh -oh. Okay, okay. You, you have, you've got three. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in case it isn't clear, we've had a lot of lamb on this trip. <laughs> but it's delicious, so that's good. Yeah. Oh my goodness, this place is huge. It's like a, like a little campground almost. I've got to say, it's been pretty hot over the past few days. We were kind of out in the plains, like in Karabakh and near the Iranian border and stuff. Now it's here, there's water, mountains, nice breeze. Feels very nice. I'm really liking this region of Azerbaijan. Как дела? Все хорошо? Рад. Все хорошо? Да, конечно. What do you call in Azerbaijani? At. 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 Okay. This is At. Horse. <laughs> I'm gonna get on it. Horse name Misha. Misha. Mishka. Mishka. Hi, Mishka. Oh. So nice, okay. Thank you. Giddy up. Yeehaw! Goodbye, guys. Look at this, guys. Wow. Looks like there's lamb and cherries and everything in there. It's gonna be so tasty. Oh, that smells so good. How is it, fellas? It's really good. Shaham, good? Really good? That's a good bite. So, guys, we were joking when we came in here that we would have either lamb or maybe lamb for lunch, but it turns out we actually had both. We had two courses of lamb. First we had lamb, and then we were like, they're like, oh, there's more food coming. We're like, okay, I guess it'll be kebab. And it's grilled lamb. <laughs> I actually like it, but Max here is struggling I can't a little take bit. It anymore. <laughs> Maybe drop some words of encouragement for Max in the in the comments. Please. All right, guys, we just stopped uh, on the side of the road. We're driving through some mountains, and apparently there is a very cool bridge here. Let's oh. check it out. Wow, this is beautiful. Kind of a scary bridge. Looks a little sketchy, but I'm definitely going. Here we go. Oh boy. Oh wow, it's just like chicken wire. Jeez. So this little thing is what my life is depending on at the moment. This little piece of metal. I'm going to get go back. back. Okay. Back. I've had enough. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to the middle. Wow, it's so creaky. I'm actually not as scared as I was would expect myself to be on this kind of thing. I don't know why. Maybe I'm becoming braver. Look at this guy's hat, it's very cool. Woohoo! And back across we go. Oh, I want to. Thank you. Oh, is it nice? Oh, oh, it's great. 
All right, guys. So I'm here in Lahij, uh, small town. Yes. Oh, thank you. Like this. Oh wow. my God. Oh. Thank you. I'm holding a gun, by the way. <laughs> oh my God. I'll get my own gun and then I'll. <laughs> you look cool because you have the uh, camo sleeves. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> this is my squad. We're shooters. <laughs> Professional shooters. <laughs> Maybe this will be the thumbnail. Look here. Look here. How intimidating do I look? Everybody must be Hey. Wow. Oh my gosh. Algeria versus Pakistan. Dalata. You look great, man. So good. <laughs> the Kazakhs are very serious. I've been trying to joke with them this whole time. Yeah, that escalated quickly. We just had like a full-blown... Full-scale war. Yeah, full-scale war with guns and swords and skull-crushing spike ball things. Actually, this town is so beautiful, though. Talk so. Thank you. <laughs> Oh wow, look at that. Yeah. 1868, this, this, uh... Wow. Nice and cold and fresh water. And you can drink it. Yeah? Right from the mountains. Delicious. Alrighty guys, the adventure continues tomorrow. I think it's basically our last day, with the full group at least, because then people are gonna start departing. One more day of adventure here in Azerbaijan. See you guys tomorrow, good night. Good morning guys. Uh, if you're wondering why I look like death right now, it's because I got out of bed like three minutes ago and had to pack up really quickly because my alarm was set for an hour later than I intended it. Anyway, now it is light out, obviously. I wanna show you guys the outside and the view from the balcony of my room here. Look at this, oh my goodness, here we go. All right guys, I'm feeling a little better. I had a cup of coffee and an omelet. We're down here in the lobby now, we're about to depart. Daleta, dobry jutra. Dobry jutra. Alrighty guys, we're going to explore a bit of the area of Shemachi, and apparently we're going to an alpaca farm. <laughs> so here we go. Guys, we've reached Alpaca, Azerbaijan. Let's see what it's all about. I already love this building. Look at that airbrush painting. They've got bean bags. Boom. <laughs> This is great. We're in like an alpaca classroom or something. It's too difficult to brush the wool. Yerara G, are you ready to feed an alpaca? Yes, this, is, this will be an amazing experience. <laughs> <laughs> we will free a few of ourselves in Machu Picchu. I love this place. It's like, they have an Instagram. Look at this. They have branded bags for holding grass to feed the alpacas. And now we're going to meet them. I'm so excited. Do you guys sell these overalls? What? Do you sell the uh, uniform? Mm -hmm. you, oh, we really? can buy it? Oh, no, 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 you, you oh. know. I like it so much. Oh, thank you. Oh. So, you can Hello, alpacas. No, 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 like this. Hello, llama. <laughs> Do we even do something? <laughs> 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 Who wants some grass? Oh my God. Would you like some grass? Go ahead. It's delicious. You'll love it. No? Oh, there you go. Very timid. Okay, you don't, I don't think you want to be touched. <laughs> wow, there's so many. Apaka. You want some grass? No? Nice alpaca. Nice alpaca. Yeah, it's good. Okay, okay. There you go.
Have some more. Can I touch your head? No? Okay. Maybe very gentle. No, okay, that's okay. Maybe this one? No? They seem a bit, they're very shy, you're right. Wow, what a way to end the trip. Surrounded by alpacas in the middle of Azerbaijan. Guys, I finally found a calm alpaca. A calm moment with a friend. This is my favorite one. She's so nice. Hello. All right, guys, so behind me here is the oldest mosque in all of the Caucasus. It's called Juma Mosque. It's here in Shamaki, and it was actually constructed in the year 743. Pretty incredible. But over the years, in the 18 and 1900s, it was heavily damaged due to earthquakes and also conflicts later on, and was only recently restored, I guess you could say, to its former glory in the early 2010s. Alrighty guys, we have made it back to Baku, the capital of Azerbaijan. It is the conclusion of what was an absolutely action-packed week. I'm back here now in the JW Marriott and I have a different room than last time. You can actually see a little bit of the uh, F1 Formula One racetrack being set up. You can see the track comes down like this. And yeah, apparently tomorrow in this hotel it's going to be at like 100% uh, capacity and it's going to be a lot of the Formula One drivers staying here. I'll be sure to let you guys know over on Instagram if I see any of them. So definitely follow along on Instagram if you're not already. I'm always posting live updates there. Guys, that's going to be about it for me from here in Azerbaijan. Thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed the videos. If you aren't already, please do consider becoming a subscriber. It really means the world to me and helps me to continue traveling and bringing you more content from around the world. So thank you guys so much again, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.